Hey guys, how you doing? This is Dream Moose Tarot here, here for another reading for the sign of Libra. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Greatly appreciated. Thank you for those who subscribe, those who recently subscribed, and those who subscribe in the near future. All is welcome. Cross watchers, grab a seat. All right? I won't hold you guys any longer. Um, please take what resonates, leave what doesn't. This is why I strongly ask you guys to subscribe, subscribe, because you just never know when you're needed to um, hear this message, okay? You never know what the future holds, all right? And there is no time, nor gender, in um, tarot, all right? So, yes, I got um, new decks for you guys, and there's more coming soon, just to get some some messages, all right, out there sent to you guys, okay? <clears throat> Angels, universe, spirits, any messages you would like for me to deliver to the sign of Libra, please and thank you. Oh, all right, one more, one more, please and thank you. Yeah, that was too much. We're definitely not taking that. Let's see if this was. I am the jealous type, so please do not try and test me. <laughs> okay, straightforward, you know. I'm struggling to overcome my addictions. I've come a long way, but I still still need help. Okay. <clears throat> and addiction doesn't necessarily have to mean um, drugs, alcohol, any of that. Addicted to always constantly stalking someone to make sure that they're not cheating, to make sure they're not stepping out the relationship, okay? Because um, I feel like this person that you're dealing with plays no games when it comes to you. They're really in um, attracted to you. They really, um, really favor you. Um, and if you are in love, this person is in love with you, Okay. This person is in love with you. <clears throat> and I think behind their rage and sometimes their attitude and, you know, um, mishaps and the things that they do is because, you know, um, they, they went through a lot of trauma, okay? A lot of betrayal in their, in their past, okay? And sometimes when we don't heal properly or do the necessary, you know, things to heal... Um, because I don't think we fully, fully heal. Um, and sometimes it does take some time, you know? That's why we, we, we stay out of relationships for a year, two years, three years. And then when we, we meet someone, we still are hesitant, you know? We're still, we're still, you know, um, we still don't know if we should take it further with this person, you know? That's because... The healing is still, you know, the healing and the hurt and the betrayal, you're still afraid. You know, it's still it's still there in a, in a way. It just don't hurt you the way it once did, you know, but it still exists in, in, in a sense, okay? I hope you understand, and I hope I didn't confuse anybody. I haven't been completely honest with you, okay? I don't know if you or your person has a... a has a seat. And this makes me want to open... Oh, hey, we're going to spill the tea. Because I want to know what it is that this person haven't been completely honest with you. Or you could be not completely honest with this person about how you actually really feel. And to be honest, I'm starting to really feel as though this person has been suppressing how they actually really feel towards you. That's why they'll have the attitude, you know, and feel and be nonchalant. They act like they they don't, you know, really really want you the way you want them. They do. I think that's that's the, you know, the what they're not being honest about. This person really does care about you immensely okay and they don't want nobody else to have you they don't want no one to see you the way they see you okay okay all right see legal issues bad contracts i feel like this person um behind the scenes had struggled um with past relationships made bad judgments um took on a lot of took on a lot of um how how shall I say this? Took a lot of um, duties, okay? Like there will uh, they have this control issue. They want to be the head of. All right, you're going through something. All right, I'm gonna take that on. 
You're going through something. Okay, I'm going to take that on. And then not realizing that you're going to burn yourself out doing that. I think this person realized that people took them for granted. And this is why they're overprotective. Okay? And jealous and, you know, um, territorial towards you, Libra. Because of the people that hurt them in the past. Okay? They've, they've made, they made, um, people made promises to them that they did not keep, okay? So that's why at times they're very nonchalant and act like they're, <laughs> this card just got unimpressed when they are. They like everything about you, okay? They like everything, all right? Come on now. And this sometimes, and with this card off the grid and intelligent, this person is very clever and what they do to get your attention. They are very clever when it comes to getting your attention. Okay? And they don't want nobody else to get your attention. They don't want you to slip out the cracks. They don't. Okay? <laughs> when I tell you that this person does not play when it comes to you and um the, you know, the... The attention that others give you or the time or anything like that. But what's crazy is that this person acts nonchalant. Like, you know, it's it's nothing when in reality, oh my God, this person's constantly thinking about you. They're constantly, you're constantly on their mind. Constantly. Okay? All right, ancestors. Um, any messages that you like for me to deliver to the sign of Libra, please and thank you. Use the triggers. All right. I need to be in a relationship as as I don't know how to be alone. Okay? Didn't I say that earlier about healing? Some people don't do the necessary things to heal because they're afraid to be alone. And that's why they'll bring, you know, um, you know, burdens and the way they used to do things, the way they used to be control, you know, controlling and have to make sure they know where the person's at at all times. You you can't always know what your person's doing at all times. You can't, okay? When I feel overwhelmed and not in control, my behaviors become manic and... Hello! <laughs> Thank you, universe, for confirming. When I feel overwhelmed and not in control, my behaviors become manic and compulsive. We ain't hear nothing about control over here until when I said it, Right? And then now here this card comes to confirm that. This person always wants to feel in control of the situation. And when they don't feel like they're in control of the situation, they will act impulsive. Okay? They will do the like things in like and you're looking like did you really have to do that? Did you really have to say that? Why is my person acting this way? And that's because they want to a sense of power, a sense of ownership of knowing that you need them or want them at all times and that you don't seek others they want to make sure you you are really destined to be with them and only them and only have eyes only for them so this person will make it seem as if you know everything's good in their world and they're not worried about you and everything's cool yeah that's that's just a facade that's just a mask that they're trying to to cover up. Okay? This person's into you. Like white rice on a pot. I'm telling you. Very into you. Very stick to you. Okay? Excuse my metaphors, but I'm just saying. Alright. Mm-mm. They ha they it's this sense of control of always having to, you know, when I'm not confident with who I am, I will act. I will act in superficial ways. Oh my God. In superficial ways. And didn't I say that? It's a mask. It's a facade. When they do not feel like they're, you know, when they don't feel confident, if they feel like you're eyeing some or giving somebody else attention, you know, or they don't feel like the attention's on them, they will act nonchalant. They will act like they're unimpressed. When in reality, that's not really what it is. Don't let this person fool you, Libra. Do not let this person fool you. You're on their mind. 24-8. I'm telling you. 
24-8. There, there's, there, there's no doubt about it. And when I say 24-8, you know how it's 24-7, but you, it exceeds. And you too. This is why you're here, Libra. Because you're just into this person just as much as they're into you. To let's, let's, come on, let's call a spade a spade. Hello. You know what I mean? Um... And this person hasn't been completely honest about the, how they feel towards you. They haven't. And that's because they they sometimes lack confidence. Because they don't know who you're giving your attention to. Are they better than them? All these, you know, insecurities sometimes arouses. You know, and, and, and it surface because they don't know where your mindset is and how you really truly feel towards them. But it's the same. It's mutual feelings. If not stronger in one party, but it's mutual feelings. Okay? So hold on tight to this person. This person might act aloof a little bit, but they mean well. They really do. They mean well. But that's all I have for you, Libra. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Greatly appreciated. Till next time, stay blessed. Stay blessed. Peace.